demonstrate a simple video tutorial. I'm going to quantify starch, 0.1% starch solution. I prepared a 2-4 serial dilution of starch solution. And from there, I'm going to add 10 microliter of iodine. Starch and iodine, I'm going to get a blue-black coloration. Place it in the cuvette. Put inside visible spectral photometer. And I'm going to get my standard calibration curve, which is here. So I have my starch standard calibration curve. And from there now, I'm going to do my enzyme study, starch solution. I'm going to use amylase as a source of the enzyme. So this is my starch iodine solution. Place it inside the visible spectral photometer. And from there, I'm going to add my enzyme. I'm going to add 10 microlit of amylase enzyme. We can use different enzyme from different source. I'm going to start my data collection. Start my data collection now. So this is, I got my absorbance before I add my enzyme. So when I add my enzyme in, there will be a decrease in absorbance because the blue-black coloration will fade over time because the enzyme will digest starch break it down and the color will fade over time. There will be a decrease in absorbance. I'm going to add my amylase enzyme in. Once I add my amylase enzyme, there will be a decrease in absorbance and the decrease in absorbance will represent the rate of enzyme activity. So we can use absorbance against time for enzyme studies. Thank you.